it's Tuesday, July 13th, and this is part two of my writing vlog, writing the first draft of my novel, film novelization, Misophonia. It is 3.52 p.m. and I am finished with part three. So this is chapter 15 all the way to chapter 20. I finished on the weekend and now I'm on part four, chapter 21. If you guys watched part one of this two-part series of drafting my film novel, you'll have seen that I created this spreadsheet calendar for July for writing the first draft of this book. I have since modified it because there were things that came up and I wasn't able to write every single day. So yeah, right now this is where I'm at. Today is Tuesday the 13th and my goal is to write two chapters, but I'm honestly not too sure if I'll be able to write the second chapter today because I do have a lot of work from my other job. I recently took on more work from that job, so it's just a lot of work. <laughs> Even if I end up cutting the time into the week after that, it honestly should be fine because it's moving along pretty well. This is why I set this schedule for myself to have it done as early as possible because I knew there might be some setbacks and there might be some things that are getting in the way of me finishing it by my own personal deadline. So I usually always account for things like this happening when I set deadlines. That's why I you know, I had set it originally to finish it, I think, by tomorrow, by Wednesday, but, you know, stuff comes up, so now it got pushed back. But that's okay, because we're still on track to finishing it by the end of this week, and once again, even if it cuts into the week after that, it's not a big deal, I think, because I think that it's coming along well. I think I'm going to do a sprint today to try and get chapter 21 finished. I started it, but I haven't finished it. So that I'm going to get done today at least, at the very least. Um, I probably will not get chapter 22 done today, but there's always tomorrow. Hello everyone, it is Saturday, July 17th today, and I know I haven't vlogged in a while, um, but I just wanted to update you guys on where I'm at with the book. So, as you can see, I have almost finished part four. Um, chapter 21, 22, 23, 24 is all done, and now I just need to do 25, 26, and 27, and then I'm finished with part 4. I plan to try and write that all today, because I just have the time, it's a Saturday, and it's raining outside, which has now become normal for Toronto. But yeah, that's what I'm going to work on today. I finished all my other work for my other job, so I have some time and I want to use that. And after that, I only have one more part to do. I decided to extend the book to 35 chapters because it just made more sense. Uh, before that, I would planned to do 30, but 35 chapters makes more sense and the book is very quickly ramping up i mean the plot is ramping up so we're almost at act three which i just learned about from my friend kelly who's read save the cat she talks about the different acts that 
are present in a story structure. It's very, very interesting stuff. But anyway, we're almost at act three. If you've read Save the Cat or watched Kelly's videos and yeah. That's right. Hello everyone, it's Sunday, July 18th. And I spent this morning really sprint riding, like really hard. <laughs> and I managed to get up to chapter 29 finished. So part four is now completely done. That's chapter 21 to 27. And now I'm on the final part, part five. And I think that we've reached act three because it's really, really ramping up. And I don't even know, remember how many chapters I wrote this morning. I think I actually did from chapter 25. Yeah, one, two, three, four. I wrote four chapters this morning, guys, four chapters four chapters that is a lot for me and i think i might actually try and finish this today so we'll see how that goes but i'm really really sprinting i'm really on a roll you know i don't have any other work to do today so i could get this done potentially today and if not today then tomorrow that would be great because it is already the 18th and yeah i want to get to going over the book again afterwards so i'll let you guys know how this goes all right see you guys later all right guys it's still sunday sunday july 18th i didn't think i would be writing this much today but I literally wrote one, two, three, four, five, six chapters today. And there are five chapters left. Should I be insane and finish this entire book today? What do you guys think? Should I do it? It's uh, 8.45 p.m., by the way six chapters i think that's a record for me i think i wrote more today i wrote more chapters today than i did on the 10k challenge that's insane <laughs> i'm on a roll guys should i should i keep going i think i may keep going but i'm gonna take a break and eat and then i'll keep going i'll let you guys know how it works out but I definitely reached my goal for the day. And if I leave the rest for tomorrow, I'm pretty okay with that because I wrote a lot today. Anyways, I'll, s I'll let you guys know what happens. All right, so I ended up, oops. <laughs> I ended up writing 10 chapters yesterday. Um, I finished up to chapter 34 and then today I just finished chapter 35 so it is Monday July 19th right now 10 12 p.m. and yeah I think I'm insane I literally wrote 10 chapters yesterday I think that's about 20,000 words. Um, yeah. I mean, to be fair, I did have the script on the side, so I wasn't writing exactly from scratch. I had the end laid out there for me. I just needed to convert it into novel form. Um, but... I did it. The first draft is finally finished and I feel really good. And I'm going to sleep really well knowing that 
I finished the first draft. So now I'm gonna shoot the director an email and let him know I put together a list of questions which I'm going to ask and then I'm gonna set to work on the editing process. But I guess even before the editing process, I want to go through it again without the script and add in all the parts that I not necessarily missed, but all the parts that make it unique to the main character. So, you know, less external, more internal to the main character. There's going to be a lot of parts like that. I've added in a bunch like that already, but I'm going to add more scenes like that in. So yeah, we'll see how that goes. All right, I think I might end this video here. If you liked this video, give it a like down below. And if you want to hear more about my updates for this film novelization, then subscribe to my channel and you'll be notified for future videos. Thanks again for watching and I hope to see you next time.